To begin our talk on reservoir pressure, let's first define the term pressure gradient. Pressure gradient is a scale of pressure differences in which there is a uniform variation of pressure from point to point. The pressure gradient of a column of fresh water is approximately 0.433 psi per foot. Before you is a normally pressured sandstone reservoir. The reservoir is considered to be normally pressured because the sand outcrops at the surface. If the sand outcrops at the surface, the pressure exerted or the pressure of the reservoir is the result of the fluid densities in the sandstone and not the overburden of the rock. A normally pressured reservoir is one where the formation fluid pressure is equivalent to approximately 0.465 psi per foot water extending from the depth to the surface. 0.465 psi per foot, which is equivalent of pressure exerted at any given depth by a column of water with 10% salt solution. Pressure exerted in a reservoir is the combination of two prime variables, depth and density of the fluid. An abnormally pressured reservoir might be abnormally pressured because of the Ortesian effect. In this example, we see a sandstone that outcrops at an elevation greater than the rig elevation. Therefore, the density of the fluid in the reservoir might not change. However, the height of the column of fluid, the depth, would change uh, as the outcrop is much higher than the drilling rig as it might outcrop in the mountains. This is another example of an abnormally pressured reservoir. However, unlike the Artesian effect, where the sandstone outcropped at an elevation greater than the rig elevation, uh, there is no outcrop. Thus, the pressure exerted in the reservoir is not only the result of the pressure of the fluid, but also the result of the overburdened rock as it squeezes and puts pressure on the fluid that's inside the reservoir. A lenticular trap is caused by a change of permeability within a rock layer. Abnormal pressure is pressure exceeding or falling below the pressure to be expected at a given depth, higher or lower than 0.465 psi per foot. Abnormal pressure can occur in one of two ways. A reservoir that does not have a connection to the surface such reservoirs are usually surrounded by impermeable formations. A lenticular trap is such an example. Two, the Artesian effect, where the outcrop is at an elevation greater than the rig elevation. <laughs>